Now to a story we first brought you on WKRG.com. If you've been to the Fairhope Beach this week, chances are you have noticed something new on the shore. A bright blue handicapped accessible beach mat has been donated to the city, and it's a big deal for a lot of residents who may not have had access to the beach before. An official ribbon cutting took place this week. WKRG.com mobile journalist Blake Brown was there. Yeah, this new beach mat may not seem like much, but this is a big deal for Fairhope Beach. It's 150 feet long and gives people in wheelchairs a chance to actually get out on the beach instead of just sitting in the pavilion and watching their friends and relatives enjoy the beach. It's the first of many new additions coming to this area of Fairhope. The Working Waterfront Project plan was completed in May thanks to Restore Act funding. Now this new mat to the north of the pier is aimed at bringing more guests down to the water who haven't had a chance to visit in the past. We made sure that there's enough of it so that people can get out on it, can, can park, can enjoy being close to the water. where They just haven't had that chance in the past. This mat was donated by the Fairhope Sunset Rotary Club. The hope is to extend the beach mat in the future. The new mat starts at the pavilion and extends outward onto the sand. And if the response is good from residents, that could mean more updates to what you see here. You can do anything with enough time and money, and that's all it takes to expand the project. If the community finds that it's something that they enjoy, that it's something that they value and want more of, that's what, that's what civic clubs are, are for. And the new mat is located just to the north of Fairhope Pier. In Fairhope, I'm Blake Brown, WKRG News 5. And of course, Blake is part of our mobile journalist team. See his stories first at WKRG.com. And be sure to follow Blake on Facebook and Twitter.